What is going on guys? My name is PokeRev and welcome to the Poke Cave. Today we are jumping into a ton of really awesome stuff that I received in the mail over the last week. There's a ton of really cool Pokemon items, products, all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to jump into it with some really rare stuff. We're starting off with an Unseen Forces completely sealed theme deck case. Guys, I've never seen one of these before. We got Lugia and Ho-Oh on the side here, Golden Sky and Silvery Ocean theme deck. So these are the theme decks. You can see them on the side there. If you guys know what those are, uh, it should be eight per case. And then the Lugia ones on the other side here, on the back is all the information. So this thing is like mint condition. And shout out to TCG Revival and Blastoise93 for making this thing happen. So Unseen Forces, that's gotta go back there. And that's just one of them. I got a couple of other ones that you guys are gonna like. This one is sick. Now this is EX Crystal Guardians, and these are all from the EX era of Pokemon. Uh, so back in the day when this stuff was really difficult to find, they didn't print a ton of it because Pokemon was not as popular back then. Um, Green Cyclone and Storm Surge are the two theme decks in this one. This one's going out to Blastoise 93, obviously. Check it out. Look at that Blastoise on the top there. It looks like it's climbing up something in the ocean, but that is a sick just sick looking box um and these are hard to find sealed like you'll find the theme the actual theme decks that are inside there sealed still every once in a while but like a, a entire case like this you don't really see them oh here's a good one you guys are gonna love this oh wow ex dragon frontiers this thing is beautiful it's got the for alligator on the top there the typhlosion Shadow Blaze and Power Wave are the two theme decks in here. You could see them on the sides, on the back. I mean, Beyond the Horizon lie the Dragon Frontiers. That's it. I mean, look at this thing. Beautiful. Another one. And then there is one more. I'm going to show you guys this one. It's another. And these are all really popular EX era sets. Like Crystal Guardians, Dragon Frontiers, Unseen Forces, and EX Delta Species. You got the Crobat on there. Rapidash on the top. Let me show you guys the size of these. I mean, these look perfect. So there's the Crobat. You can see a better view of it. Behold the newest species of Pokemon. Breakthrough and uh, Steeplechase. So, wow. That's a little tear there on the side, but I mean, just seeing these in person and finding these are just unbelievable. So let's keep moving. I'm gonna show you guys some more stuff. Now this next one, I'm really nervous about. So check this out. I have one box here and it says, US Customs and Border Protection examined. You know what? It came from Canada and then another one got the same tape, US Customs and Border Protection. So guys, I don't know. I'm really nervous. I think this, I think this is a booster box. So I've seen this happen before where these get looked at by customs and they actually open up the booster box. So I literally have no idea what is gonna happen right now. There's the possibility that customs actually opened up the booster box. Oh, I'm so nervous. Okay, it looks like it's still tight on the wrap. We're gonna find out right now. I think it might still be sealed. Let's see. Please still be sealed unless they went in from the bottom. I've seen them rip in the bottom of booster boxes before. I've seen it happen to a Skyrish booster box, believe it or not, one time they ripped right into it. Oh, it's still sealed. Thank you. <laughs> okay, this is a mint gym challenge booster box. Still sealed. I gotta throw that in there because I, my heart is actually beating because I've seen it happen so many times where customs We'll open the package and then they'll say, oh, what's this? And then they'll just rip it open, having no idea whatsoever uh, what it's worth or really caring at all. That is beautiful. So this is going into the sealed collection. I needed one of these in unlimited and in mint condition like this. This has got to be straight from the case. I mean, this thing is perfect. So gym challenge. And that has the, uh, the Blaine's Charizard, all that stuff. We opened up one of these a week or two ago. If you guys want to check that video out, I'll link it down below. But we still have one more customs. So we're not, we're not out, we're not out yet. We got one more that was examined by customs. I've actually never had anything, I don't believe, 
examined by customs before. So this, I believe this is the first for me. It might happen one time, but I can't, can't recall. So, and that's just basically the customs is checking to make sure that there's nothing illegal in there or anything like that. So we got another booster box. I'm nervous about this one. Okay, so I think this actually, okay, cool. So we got where we got this from. Thank you. So a little thank you note. Oh, cool. I believe is this Korean? Um, Legend of Blue Eyes. Ooh, this is awesome. Thank you so much for the extra. And this is what I purchased. So these don't come sealed. The box outside doesn't anyway. Uh, Lament cards. You got Charizard, Blastoise, and Venusaur on the top. So these are like an interesting thing that came out back in the year 2006. Got the OG Pokemon on there. Second form evolutions. And then the original starters. It contains 24 packets. 2006, 1995, 2006. Uh, that was the price on the back there. And see, so these are like the cards. They're like clear. You got Bellsprout, Lapras, and Cloyster. So they were kind of like clear. I'll show you guys a pack of these too. Let me know if you want to see these get opened up on the channel. They're pretty interesting, but you can actually see what cards might be inside here. So I see a Scyther on that one and something else back there. So yeah, they're clear. I think there's a three maybe in each of these. So Lamin cards. I thought that was cool. And I have some loose ones, so I definitely want to keep that one all together. So we're going to keep moving, though. Um, we got some more stuff here. Let's see what we have in this box now. So this one has a bunch of little Pikachus on the outside. It looks like it came from Japan, probably. So I'm going to I'm actually going to move this out of the way because I'm taking up so much space with those theme decks. OK, let's see what's inside here. And a lot of this stuff I kind of just order and then I don't get to it for a long time or it doesn't get here for a while. Whoa, we got some origami, I think that's what it's called. Um, cool. This is like handmade little extra thing there. Put that back there. And then a bunch of bubble wrap. Oh, here. So uh, <laughs> I got talked into buying this. Not talked into. I wanted it after I saw it. But Ram Style told me about these. And I had to pick it up because I thought it was too cool. He sent me the link and I was like, got it. I'm buying it. Once I've seen it, I can't unsee how cool it is. So this is like a Mewtwo figure, SH figure arts, I believe is how you say it, from Bandai. So these are cool. Uh, I think they do these limited. So here's the back. I mean, you can change the face, change how you pose and articulate it. So I thought that was really cool. I just grabbed that. And there's a bunch of more stuff here. So here's another box. I'm gonna crack into this one and we're gonna see what we have in here. I'm gonna go down the side like so and I always cover up the labels on these so I actually I really have no idea what's inside each of these Ooh, okay so we got we got bubble wrap and is this extras Ooh, okay oh the analytic Gengar cool so they are on um, Instagram so we're gonna pull this out of here and we are gonna whoa we have Four legend makers. Now I believe these were thrown in as extras to open up on the channel. Um, and then we're gonna send them back. So we're gonna see what we get. It'll be like a little fun opening there. So that is awesome. So there is their information there. If you wanna follow them on Instagram and let's see what else we have in here. So those will be fun. Let me know if you guys wanna see those get open, those legend maker. That's from the EX era. So hopefully we get some cool stuff out of here. There it is. Ah, uh, I feel like it was so long ago that I ordered this, but I, it's my fault though. I had it sitting around for like forever, but this is a Call of Legends booster box. It's the only one in the series. Oh, this is like epic. Like every single card in here is epic. So, uh, I mean, Lugia is right on there, Groudon, Deoxys, like this set was sick and this is a really tough one to find. So yeah, I appreciate uh, you send this out my way safely and everything. And yeah, make sure you follow them on Instagram. So that was a really cool one. And yeah, there's four of these, I believe here. So if you guys want to see these get opened in a video, we can definitely do that. EX Legend Maker. Oh, it's all four artworks as well. So that'll be sick. Um, hopefully we get some awesome stuff out of those packs, but we're not done just yet because we have some more stuff here. So another one, and this is actually, uh, I believe from a fan. Oh, is that a I didn't even look in here. I just saw the note and I wanted to. Oh, I see what that is. So, Pogarev. 
This from Paul, and I know exactly who you are, Paul. I see you all the time um, at the lives and in the chat. Here is a gift to the one and only Poker Rev. Thanks for all the awesome openings and all you do for the Pokemon community. Keep it up, Rev. I love the nostalgia. Thank you so much, Paul. I appreciate you. Wobbuffet for the Poke Cave luck, a friend for Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. Um, salute to the King of Pokemon openings, Paul. Hashtag Gengar fan. Thank you so much, Paul. That's an awesome drawing. I love Gengar. Hashtag Gengar. And uh, I thought so. Oh, that is awesome. That's definitely going in the back there. We got the Wobbuffet. Oh, that is cool. I love Wobbuffet. Sick. Thank you so much, Paul. Definitely going to make good use of that. Maybe it'll bring us the luck as well. So besides that, guys, we have another package here. And I actually got to open this on my lap because it's pretty big. I can't open it back there but i believe this should be the final pack <laughs> so let me see what we got in here and let me know what you guys think of these videos i just thought i'd do them because i go through my mail and i might as well share the experience with you guys oh okay so there's actually two of these i'll just show you one as long as one's not open okay yeah so there's two of these so i don't know some of you guys might see at upper deck on the side there let's see if you guys can guess which TCG this is and I'm gonna uh, Should I open it? Mm, yeah, I'll open it. Uh, Yeah, gonna open it. Gonna open it. It's just clear tape. It's not factory tape. Uh, so Oh, here we go. This is well, these are bent, but that's just how they get over time. This is Magician's Force Yu-Gi-Oh fans out there. I thought this was a good price a good deal. These are blisters of Magician's Force uh, a little bit of a shame that they're bent on the top there but that just happens over time due to i believe like moisture and stuff like that so there should be 24 in these cases so we got some Yu-Gi-Oh stuff in magician's force this is an awesome set so yeah guys that is pretty much gonna be it so let me know what you guys think of this series of going through mail and everything like that i'll continue it as long as you guys are enjoying it and yeah that's gonna be it we got wobbuffet right there hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you on the next one